And police believe is connected to missing friends from Temple who were found dead in Oklahoma two weeks ago. Maya Maxwell is now in a Bell County Jail on a half a million dollar bond. She was extradited back here to Texas last night from Michigan and Channel 6's Jasmine Caldwell spoke to our legal analyst about what this means for Maxwell now that she is back in the hands of Texas authorities. Hey Jasmine. Well, hey Chris and Leslie, our legal analyst said for detectives it's a race against time to start the process of interrogation and speaking to Maxwell about what she may or may not know about the disappearance and death of Jenna Scott and Michael Swearingen. She also said the fact that police had to extradite her back to Texas drives home the importance of Maxwell's involvement in the case. Now, as we told you before, Maxwell already admitted to being involved with leaving Michael Swearingen's vehicle in Austin in hopes of concealing it from law enforcement. Maxwell is an acquaintance of Cedric Marks, who was the ex-boyfriend of Jenna Scott. And in this case, um, it looks like this woman is being charged as a co-defendant. Mo more than likely, um, prosecutors, authorities would try to talk to this woman and get her to cooperate against the other person being charged. Now, Maxwell was living with Marks and his wife when she was arrested. Marks is still in jail in Michigan on a burglary charge for breaking into Scott's home this summer and is waiting to be extradited back to Texas. Now, Maxwell is in jail on a third degree felony offense of tampering with physical evidence. Chris.